Okay, just them two. I can deal with that. Especially if I can club, you know, in two hits, take one out. Oh my god, look at all the dots. Oh my god. Look at all the red dots. Hey, welcome back, everybody. The Accidental Survivor here. And we are back with another episode of Seven Days to Die. This is the Romero mod. <clears throat> and uh, we're going to go try to see if we can get a Tier 4 mission. Now, I tried to get Big T um, a couple days ago to see if he could join us. And he's got the game. He's got the mod. We weren't able to get it to work, though. Um, let me see. Stop humming, dude. Okay. Five kilometers. Oh, man. Because these are Tier 4. Everything is so far away. Uh, five kilometers to the north. I've had just the tad. Well, all right. All right. Yeah. I'm hoping it's not in the snow zone. Uh, let's see if we can find it on the map. Okay, it said five kilometers to the north. What the hell? Ooh. Oh, it's in that other town. Okay, well, at least it's in the regular sp uh, space. I found the trader here, except I didn't want to start over with the tier one missions again. So, damn. We're going to need to take a trip on the mini bike. <clears throat> I got plenty of gas. Let me make sure I got enough food on me. Let's see what we got. Uh, I got no food on me. We got 21. Uh, let's go ahead and drop that money off. Oh, where the hell is my other money? Where the hell did I put that? I may have thrown it in here, maybe? I don't think so. No. There's the bike. All right, let me just put my money in here. It's probably in the bike. But we're going to get rid of that. We're going to grab a couple cans of food. Uh, there's two of them right here. We'll take that. And we'll take uh, beef lamb rations. All right. And I think that should do it. We got uh, nine water. What the hell? Let's go ahead and top that off. I think that was my flashlight I was looking at. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and head out. Get on the mini bike. What do we got in here? I hope this thing is cleared out. Awesome. And there's no money in here. Ooh. Damn it. All my, I think I spent all my money. Yeah, I think I did. Okay. I did. I definitely spent all my money. But we got 95% gas. I got 1,600 uh, gas in my vehicle. And we are going to head out. So I'm not going to bore you with me driving there all the way just like this. So uh, unless something happens, I'll see you when we get there. Okay. I went ahead and stopped. We're still a ways away. Oh, I can't zoom. I can't zoom out any further. We got to get up there. We're getting closer, but I, I realized I forgot my sleeping bag again. Plus, there's a vehicle here I wanted to check. So we're gonna make a we're gonna craft a sleeping bag really quick. Ooh, I will take the repair kits. I'll leave everything else. So let's uh let me get my hands. Let's put that away. All right, I got it. Let me put the shotgun here. And I think I need a lot of this fiber to make a uh, sleeping bag. So let's see. Um, oop, wrong one again. <laughs> Bedroll. What do we need? 14. I have 14 fibers. I need 10. So let's go ahead and craft that. We're going to have a new bedroll. We'll get rid of this. All right. So we'll, we'll put that bedroll down. What do I have the shotgun? Oh, we'll put that bedroll down. Once we uh, get to our destination, uh, 510. Well, we got a full tank again. I still got over a thousand gas left, but that's all right. We're gonna need that to get back. But anyway, let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and continue on. Oh, we got the city coming up. We're still 1.2 kilometers away because I think it's on the far side of the city. But uh, yeah, we're coming up to the outskirts of it right now. One kilometer, roughly. And uh, I wouldn't mind being here. You know, there's a lot of places here to explore, too. I mean, obviously... Oh, there's one of those silos are here. Ooh. I may I may have to set base up here. This is a lot safer than the wasteland. <laughs> but uh, it's very similar to the, the place I'm in as far as difficulty, I think. It's just bigger. And uh, we, may, we may have to look at that. We may have to look at moving our base, or at least having a second base here. Oh, crap. Maybe not. There's a zip coffee. Ooh, there's zombies all over the place here. 
What's up, buddy? All right, I'm, I'm, I'm checking out the buildings. That's why I'm quiet. I'm sitting here looking at it saying, oh, man, look at that one. Yeah, ooh. <laughs> to myself, I'm saying all that. Uh, let's see. What does that say? Savage Country? I don't know if I've ever been to one of those. There's a burger joint. Yeah, I don't know if I've ever been to into a Savage Country store in this game. I may have. I just, I just don't remember. Man, look at that thing. Yeah, with the water tower. The waterworks. I've now seen that. Oh, I don't think I've ever seen that before either. You know, that, that specific uh, layout. And I know it's not new. I mean, they haven't updated the game yet uh, to the Alpha 21. Which are, they are going to be incorporating a whole bunch of new POIs, including Tier 5 POIs. But uh, they haven't added any to Alpha 20, you know, since it probably came out. I could be wrong, but yeah, I've never seen the waterworks either. Okay, we're only 200 kilometers or 200 meters away. Let's slow down here a little bit. Is it this house? Oh, I hope it ain't that construction zone. Uh, let's get a little closer. We're still a couple hundred meters away. Ooh, I don't know if I can get over there. This fence is in the way. Okay, there's a zombie. But can we squeeze past these fences? All right, I couldn't have done this in the truck. <laughs> okay, this is um, this is interesting. Is this the one that's got that? There should be like a hatch on the ground, and there's like two separate missions, really. Oh man! Oh, oh, is this a shotgun messiah? And a cargo. Why do the cargo drops always happen when I get right here by these uh, by the missions? I gotta look on the map to see where that cargo drop was. I think I think I've done these before. Oh, I've done this building here before. Let's take care of her. Oh, I freaking hate these crawlers. Yeah, it's just hard for me to time like when is a good time to swing. Um, where'd that cargo drop go? Let's find out. Um, I don't see it on the map. I'll say who's coming. All right, let's take care of these guys on the outside. And he still freaking hit me. Yeah. Uh, let's get over here, buddy. I know as soon as I fire a gun, you're going to come running. Damn, I got I to gotta fix my timing. That's the second one that hit me. And let me get a drink. I just realized that I'm thirsty. I'll take a couple drinks of water. Ooh, my food's a little low also. Let's go ahead and eat that. And we'll get another drink. And we'll eat that. Get rid of those jars, but we'll scrap these. Awesome. All right. Oh, I guess I should uh, activate this mission. Wait, where is it? Oh, it's on the other side. You know what? Let me bring the bike over to the uh, the check mark. I got to put my sleeping bag down, too, before I start this mission. Where do they want me to go in? Um. All right. I want to be able to, uh, man, this is a big freaking building. It is tier four, though. Look at this guy. Okay. Take care of all these on the outside. Let me also repair my club. Okay, there's just one over there. So let's get that club uh, repaired. And we did find the other uh, repair. We found a couple of repair kits, so that's good. Uh, let me get my sleeping bag out, and we're going to put that in the number two. And let's see if it'll let me put it out here by these trees, unless that's too close. Hopefully that's not too close to this thing. Uh, let's get that out. Let's get the shotgun back in place. I don't see me using the shotgun because, like I said, uh, it's a powerful weapon. But in this version, you got to do headshots, and shotgun just goes everywhere. All right, tier four has begun. I should have probably searched this before I did that. I I always forget to do that. Okay, I woke someone way up. There he is. Can't get the I can't get the timing right today. That's gonna that's gonna be a problem. <laughs> I just wanted to peek around the corner. 
All right, let's go back over here. And um, is this unlocked? Okay, here we go. Tier four. Oh, damn it. I'm trying to wake anybody up who may be in here. Um, anything I can search nearby? Get my headlight on. Yeah, I guess that would help. That's untouched. Come on. Ooh, nine freaking forged iron. We'll leave the other stuff. Hold on. They're hitting walls. Can I go up this wall right here? You know how it's like on a slope? Kind of. Dude, oh, what is that over there? You see that? There's somebody in white. Was that? Oh! Who the hell's hitting me? Was that the barbed wire? Or did she hit me? I think I was just... I think I hit the barbed wire. All right, I was out of stamina for sure. I'm trying to jump up there. All right, um... That was weird. I mean, that's interesting to see. There was, I think that may have been a mannequin, but it's been so long. I've not seen a mannequin in a long time. If I even, I may even be thinking of a different game. Uh, we will take all the gas. Yes, because we're down at well, we got twelve hundred now. They sound like they're outside, like right out the door. Hold on, please don't be a horde. Okay, it's just her. What am I hearing? You know, I'm, I'm scared of of these freaking hordes. I, oh my god, there is a horde. Well, it's a small horde, but there's definitely a bunch of dudes over here. Yeah, we're going to have to take care. Come on, man, get over here. i got to take care of a few of these dudes just to keep them from coming in after me. Shoot, he saw me too. Let's get rid of this one. You know, there are no time limits for these missions, as long as I don't leave the uh, vicinity. And I would not... It would be awesome if they just tear the wall down for me and I just go in and get the... Uh, but i got to kill all the zombies. i got to clear the area. I know these guys that I'm hitting on the outside right here are not part of the mission, but they are going to interfere. Okay, these guys are knocking walls down for me. They sound like they're right here, but I know they're... They're either upstairs or... No, they're not upstairs. There's somebody right here. Yeah. Let's get over here. I have barely done anything. Oh, my God. Crucible schematic. We're going to use that. We're going to take that. I don't know why I'm getting all excited. It's a crucible. You know, <laughs> I can make one now. Oh, look at all that stuff. Dude, all that forged iron I've gotten so far. I'm kind of waiting to see if anybody else shows up, you know, like through a door, like right outside here. All right. Yeah, I'm just being overtly cautious because of the, the tier difficulty level. And I've not found really anybody inside that I've killed yet. Oh, well, never mind. Oh, look at up top there. There's something up there. Okay, they may come through the door, but I think there's just one of them there. Ooh, there's a safe in here. Let's close that door up. Oh, hold on. Oh, I thought there was somebody else there. Ooh. Let's check the medicine. Uh, you know, we'll leave all that. I'm still thinking somebody's going to show up out here. But you know what? While we're here, let me ac let me access the bike. Uh, let's get the forged iron and I and the pipe, and we'll get this out too. All right. They're almost through. See, if they go through this door without me having to do it, then uh, that's one less thing I got to smash up and maybe and may make a shortcut for me too. I'm kind of refraining from taking anything like that supply stuff just yet um, because I'm trying to conserve my room, you know, and I, I'm not here to do a supply run. I will take some water if they got it. <sighs> of course, it's murky. That's locked. All right, let me check this bag. Uh, I will scrap these, and that's it. I still think... I, I'm sorry for going in and out like that. It just sounds like they're right out here. But you know what? I can always close that door to help uh, keep them from just walking straight in without without me knowing about it. Uh, we we got to get in here, so let's get the pickaxe. Ooh. 
Let's get this finished. We're definitely going in here. Let's see if we can unlock this with a pick, uh, pick lock. We've got a few of these. So, oh man, how many more do we have? Uh, I got 10 more. So let's see if we can get this thing unlocked. Dang. I think they still got some more door to go through. Okay, that's two of them we broke already. This is Shotgun Messiah, so maybe we'll find some awesome stuff in here. Come on, man, come on. It is tier four. Oh, my God. All right, at least we're down to just four. Okay, awesome. We got it, finally. Uh, Night Stalker Volume 5. Let's go ahead and use that, and we'll take the rest of that stuff. And there's a safe here, too. Oh, man. Let's see if we can do this here real quick before those zombies show up. I got a feeling they're like right freaking behind me. That's on the outside. I'm not going to worry about them. I still hear the door being hit, so I think we're okay. Come on, man. Oh, man. Okay, we got it. Uh, we're just going to take that. Because we got to get back over here. Anything else up top? Am I missing something? Sounds like there's a few of them outside here. Hold on. All right, perfect timing. They had to come at, come at me from both sides. So what did they open up for me? Dude, there's going to be like a crap load of them. Okay, that's the store I would have had to go through. So I'm actually in a place here that I shouldn't be in yet. And that's because of the zombie. Thank you. So now I can look over here and see what would I, would have been in store for me if I went in from the other door. Is there a dude on the floor right there? See, I, I think somebody's going to smash through the ceiling here. Oh, okay. Well, there's three of them there. This is a nice big courtyard here. I can always jump over this thing, I think. Let's take a look. Oh, that is mannequins. Okay, I can jump. Oh, that's like a shooting range, man. That's pretty freaking cool. You know what I mean? Like with the obstacle course and stuff. These guys are going to take out uh, one, one at a time. Ooh. Oh, I thought somebody was coming through the ceiling. This club does work really freaking good. As long as I got the stamina. I mean, usually, usually within two hits, I can uh, take their head off. And I know I've been putting in... Uh, points towards doing stuff like that too i just like i said i can't use um ooh, let's take all that you know i can't use the shotgun which is like my favorite weapon in this game uh because it's, it's you know the shot is oh my god let's take all this stuff the shot kind of spreads out you know if if that makes sense i mean i don't know if how of the oh my god i don't know if the physics of the game work the same as my uh my physics you know logically um so, yeah, I guess it could work differently. I mean, knuckle wraps. Let me, what do I get out of that? Okay, hide. I'm never going to use those knuckle things. Ooh, ammo. Okay, I'll take that stuff. Somebody's coming. I'll take the ammo. Let's get outside here so we can uh, see what we're dealing with. Who did I wake up? And from what part of the room? Um, okay. All right, she's done. Oh! <laughs> he swing at me. See, there's one more. Oh, there he is. Oh, I didn't kill him? Okay. That makes sense. He's dead now. So what do I get for these mannequins? <laughs> All right, um, we got this place mostly clear. Nobody hiding back here. Take a stone. See, it sounds like there's somebody behind me. I don't know if that's someone from, from the outside. Found a lot of that ammo. Oh, there's more over here. Oh, awesome. 
Yeah, I mean, I don't know if that's a zombie that's like just randomly walking by and then here's all this, or if that's um, one that I got to get for like the mission. Because this doesn't look like this opens. Oh, I hit her. Get on the ground. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm having a little fun. Yeah, see, I'm not going to be able to kill her easily, though. Just because uh, I can't hit her in the head. What's her health? Man, all right. Get back up. Ooh, I didn't search all these. Ooh. Let's get that one and this one. That's like a fruit smoothie. It's a Jeju smoothie. That was close. Yeah, we're going to leave her alone. She's she's going to bust in eventually, but uh, oh. I, I don't want to mess with her right now. See, I don't want to jump over this because I will be trapped, potentially. No, it looks like I can jump back over again. The hell? This dude just fell off the wall trying to get me. Come here, man. This place looks freaking dangerous. Oh my god. Crouch, crouch, crouch. Where's my, uh... Alright, we got one of them anyway. Dude, how many are there? Okay, just them two. I can deal with that. Especially if I can club, you know, in two hits take one out. Oh my god, look at all the dots! Oh my god! Look at all the red dots! Ooh! Oh, where are they coming from? Wow, where are these guys at? There are so many red dots. I'm freaking actually terrified. Here's the chest. How come these guys aren't coming over here? Okay, I'm actually glad that broke. Because I want to search this. And take it all. Where, are these guys maybe beneath me? Where's all these red dots at? They're like, they're still like in the buildings. Maybe they're just showing me where they're all at. Oh, man. Oh, there's my bolt. They've, are they underneath me? Oh, hold on. I don't want to get trapped over here. They're upstairs. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Here's it comes a few. Dude, this is... Big T needs to be here for this. Holy crap. Okay. Ooh, nice. Let's take that quickly. Ooh, a helmet. I think I'm going to get overburdened super quick. These guys, I think, are trying to bust out from up top. That's what it sounds like. That or they're coming up from underneath the ground. And uh, I was trying to get over here. Yeah, through here, there's something. Oh, man. Yeah, they're upstairs, I think. Were they hitting the walls over here? Hold on. Oh, God. Scared the crap out of me. She's still not dead. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> okay, so that was her I heard. Dude, where are all these zombies at? Look at all the red dots. Okay, let me let me fix some stuff real quick because I've got a lot of weight. I need to get rid of some stuff. Um, let's go ahead and drink this. Stamina regeneration and some water. We need both. And let's get rid of the empty jar. Um, I guess I, I have to... not. I mean, yes, I got to kill them all, but I don't think they, they get triggered. Like, I thought when I saw the red dot, that means that like all of them woke up and they're coming at me. Now it's just, it's just like they're standing there waiting. And I got to go clear this freaking... At least I know where they're all at, though. <laughs> Damn. Um, I'll take this, but that's it. Oh, I'm hungry again? Dude, hold on. I think I left all my food in my car. Uh, in my car. <laughs> in my... um, In the bike. Let's get rid of that blood bag, too. We don't want that. And I'll think of other stuff to get rid of as I need to. But okay, let's let's trigger these guys a little bit at a time. We got those. Why is there a door there? Oh, they busted through here. Ooh. 
This is like a shoot house. That's pretty cool. Uh, we'll leave that alone. Okay, we woke somebody up. Let's, let's back up a little bit. Where are they coming in from? Let's take a look up here. I know they're in this door. Okay. Let's get down. Back outside. <laughs> Damn. I'm doing this very cautiously, if you can't tell. Because I don't know how many are coming and from what direction. You know, they could walk right out that door. Shoot, here they come. And my stamina is hurting, too. Because I'm carrying extra crap. So where did they go? Oh, here they come. Damn. All right, I'll take take a couple. Okay, at least I knocked him down. I heard that clunk from his helmet. Okay, she's taken care of. Okay, I don't think he's dead because he's still on fire. Ooh, here they come. Here come the other ones. He's still on fire. Let's... Okay, he's out of the way. Okay, I mean, he may be dead. Okay, we got him. We got him. Just be careful. Now I think I woke these guys over here up too. Tier four. <laughs> well, so far, I've been able to do it with just a club. Okay. Still four dudes over that way. And a crap load over here. I want to be able to jump on this and get over if need be. That's why I'm kind of chilling out by the door. Letting them come to me. But I think those, are guys, those guys are upstairs there. No, there's one, two. There's a couple upstairs. Yeah, look at them busting through the wall up there. I want to go in there and give them a hand, but I don't want these guys to break through before these guys, and then I got people behind me. It is getting dark, but we got our helmet light, if need be. What's over here? Let's close that up. Ooh, we search this. While we're here, I'll take some gas. That's, that's deceptive how they put all the chests out here, knowing that you're going to have to fight these dudes to even think about opening them up. Okay, we got one. Oh, is it just her? I think other people are hitting walls trying to break free. There's two of them. Let's get her. I wish I had a countdown. <laughs> like, you need seven more zombies. All I see is just a crap load of red dots. Oh, we got another one. All right. Damn, how long is it going to take these dudes to freaking get out? Let me go upstairs. Oh, damn it. I was like, where the hell did he go? All right, there's one. I'm wet. Oh, the rain? Okay. All right, we got them out of the way. So while the guys down below are still working on trying to get out, we'll search this room. Ooh, three lockpicks. Um, I'll take this, though. I'll leave everything else alone. Here they come. I guess they got out. You know, I don't mind being upstairs like when they're coming at me. You know, like, like I'd be like, oh, crap, I'm trapped. You know, I just jump off of something because I can always feel like I always feel like I, I can get away. If I needed to, if I'm up higher. Like, I'll just jump down. All right, what's beyond this door? Ooh. Okay, you see how many red dots we got? I think we're mostly done. They're in these buildings here and over here. There's none over here. I just want to look. Hey, it could be something over here interesting. All right, so we got one over here. This is a big freaking room, big area. Uh-oh. Okay, I still only see a few and red dots, that is. I think they're inside this place I'm standing in right now. Let's take the ladder. Okay, there's one stuck in the floor over there. 
Yeah, it looks like right here they were inside of this. Maybe. Is she stuck over there? All right, while she's stuck, let's let's look for some gas. I'll take all this. Oh, here he comes. He just fell down the stairs. Okay. We got one of the many dots there taken care of. She's uh she's next. You're standing up. Thank you. Oh, sorry. <laughs> she took a swing at me. Come on, get up. Okay. So we got uh, like three dots, and they're all over here. Let's go ahead and take care of business. What the hell? Is there somebody behind me? Dude, freaking die already. Okay, you got two dots. Finally. There we go. Okay, that's on the outside. So we uh, returned the trader. We completed that mission. I couldn't kill that freaking lumberjack. I just think I couldn't get him in the head uh, the way, you know, needed to take him out. So who am I hearing? What is over here? This is a big building. I figured someplace like up here would, where, would be where I'd find the end loot. All right, let's, uh, and you know, that building probably the same. There may be stuff in there. Let's, uh, let's jump over here. There we go. All right, let's go back and uh, open these, uh, these chests up here, or the boxes. <laughs> I jumped all the way in here to get, oh, actually, I want all that stuff. Oh, and let me search the truck. Damn, I almost passed this thing up. Come on. Uh, we'll take all that. We're going to be tight on room, but we're only going right here. And, uh, oh, that's one unit. Damn. I thought they were two separate. But I do want the gas, especially when it's this easy to take. And let's get the rest of these boxes. We never opened up this one. Uh, so let's see. Let's uh, use my new lock picks. I think I did try it once or something and it stopped, but I was like, that's fine. <laughs> Come on, man. Damn, we might get this. All right. Let's see what we got. Ooh. Power door schematic. You know what? We're going to give this to you. And you're going to... We're going to give these to you right here. And this one. And uh, rifle part. We're going to throw that in there too. Because instead, we're going to take the ammo. I'm going to take all that ammo. Um, I'm definitely going to take these bombs. And I'm going to take trigger group auto mod. The power doors. We're going to sell that. And, uh, and we're going to take the silver nuggets. And that ought to do it right there. And let's see what we got in these uh, these crates. And then uh, we're going to have to go back to complete this uh, quest. Baton. I don't want any of that stuff. But what I'll do is uh, I'm going to wrap the episode up here once we're done. And I'll start heading back. Oh, honey, two jars of it too, dude. Um... I'll start heading back. I'll, I'll wrap the episode up, but uh, the reward we get from this, I'll include in the beginning of the next episode. Oh, Burning Shaft Mod. That's another one I wanted to find. An extra one. Um, but yeah, that is that is it. Let's get the hell out of here. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and wrap it up right here. Thank you so much for uh, watching. I really do appreciate it. Uh, make sure you tune in next week if you want to follow 7 Days to Die Romero Mod. Yeah, I'm burnt out of stamina. <laughs> you know, I should probably stay here for the... Well, I don't need to stay here. I was like, I'll stay here for the night. I keep forgetting Romero mod here. There is no, like, horde, you know, feral zombies. So it doesn't matter where I can drive all the way back during the nighttime. And uh, yeah, that's it. But anyway, let's wrap it up here. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.